Australia Police are seeking the assistance uh, of the public to help locate a missing Beverly man, Mr Michael Modesti. Mr Modesti, 33 years of age, has not been seen or heard of since Sunday the 8th of May. His vehicle was subsequently found at West Croydon on Wednesday the 11th of May. His disappearance is definitely out of character and police and his family are genuinely concerned for his safety and have concerns for his welfare. Mr Modesti spoke with his partner by phone at about 11pm on Sunday night the 8th of May and he has not contacted his son since that day. His mobile phone and bank cards were located at his home address. His blue 2005 Mitsubishi Magna registration XPC 764 was found in Chenoweth Avenue, West Croydon on Wednesday. However, it may have been left in the street as early as Monday morning, the 9th of May. Police have received information that his vehicle has been seen in the area previously, and we are currently conducting inquiries to see and identify any possible link Mr Modesti may have in the street or with vehicles or, or uh, premises within the area. Investigators will be conducting a door knock of Chenoweth Avenue West Croydon this morning and as you can see we are in the street today conducting those thorough door knocks. Anyone with information that may assist police uh, with this uh, inquiry are asked to call Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000. You obviously haven't been here for too long yet this morning but have you found anyone that, that knows him or had seen the car here before? As part of our investigation obviously uh, we've conducted uh, extensive uh, inquiries with relatives and friends um, and this is part of a portion of the investigation that we can conduct today. That what was the call that he made at 11 o'clock on the Sunday night, was there any indication from that phone call that he was in any kind of trouble or any suggestion that this was going to happen? Uh, no there isn't, no. What was the nature of the phone call? Was he was it happy? What was the talking to his partner about? No, it's part of a normal uh, phone call that he had with his partner as part of uh, some uh, uh, arrangements to meet with his uh, young child. So they he, they weren't living together. Uh, I don't know that. So he was last seen in Evanston Gardens. What was he doing in Evanston Gardens? Uh, no, not last seen in Evanston Gardens. Um, was last uh, uh, we don't know uh, the last time he was located, but he went missing from his home address uh, on Sunday. That's the last uh, time that we've known that he's been. Uh, missing. How Any concerned are you at this stage for his welfare? Yeah, we're uh, genuinely concerned, um, as are the family. We have uh, you know, serious concerns for his welfare. This is totally out of character. Uh, as stated previously, uh, both his uh, mobile phone and cars were found at his home address. Um, the vehicle was located this week. Uh, it may have been here as of Monday, hence the door knocks today. So uh, all of those things add up to uh, indicate to us that this is out of character and we do have some serious concerns. Did you find anything in the car or have you done testing on the car? Uh, we've uh, seized the vehicle and uh, we'll be conducting uh, an examination of that vehicle, but uh, nothing that we've indicated uh, in relation to this uh, missing persons investigation Your at this investigations, stage. Has it uncovered anything untoward that he may or may not have been involved with drugs or other sort of criminal activity at all? No, as I said, we've got to keep an open mind. Uh, you know, as stated, uh, this is uh, totally out of character. Uh, we do hold genuine concerns, so we've got to keep an open mind. It's a very broad investigation, so we've got to undertake uh, a, a number of inquiries. Um, in addition to the door knocks conducting today, uh, obviously there is a strong focus uh, on the residents that are living in this area. However, we do ask uh, members of the public if they have any information at all in relation to the disappearance um, of Mr Modesti, that they do call us on Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000. Would you say at this stage this is suspicious? Uh, we can't rule that out. You know, we have to keep an open mind um, and we have to make sure that we're uh, doing as uh, thorough as an investigation as we can and obviously seek uh, support from members of the public. Thank I'm you. guessing there hasn't been any uh, bank activity or anything like that to indicate he is somewhere else? Uh, as part of the investigation uh, we conduct inquiries with the banks um, but at this stage I can't uh, elaborate on um, any of those findings. Are you doing any door knocking around his home in Beverly? Uh, we've conducted inquiries at his home address, that's part of the normal investigation and the uh, investigation uh, so far has been quite extensive um, and that has included uh, speaking to both uh, a number of people that are known to him and that may know of his whereabouts. So as stated, uh, yeah, we have some real concerns about his safety and uh, this is a priority for us. How far is his home from here? Uh, it's at Beverly.
so it's not too far from this location. There's been some concern on social media that it's taken a week for this to come out publicly, but have police been working behind the scenes during that time? Uh, yeah, we've been working uh, extensively behind the scenes and with the family, and uh, certainly working very hard uh, to make sure that we can do all that we can uh, to locate um, Mr Modesti safe and well. Do you have any leads at the moment? Uh, as stated, we've got to just keep an open mind and we've just got to, to uh, make sure our uh, investigation is extensive and thorough and uh, cover as many bases as we can. Has his partner given, an interview, uh, given a statement to police? Uh, that has been part of our normal investigative process. As stated, uh, we've spoken to all witnesses and uh, relatives in relation to this. Okay, so thank you. Any of interest? Uh, not at this stage. Is the missing man or any of his associates known to police in any other capacity? Um, he is known to, uh, to us, but uh, um, not to any great extent. But obviously that has to incorporate uh, part of our ongoing investigation. What did he do for a living? Um, I'm unaware of what his occupation is.